I'm Steve Wiley with UBM TechWeb, and I'm here with Randy Bias, the CEO of Cloud Scaling. We're here at, uh, at the Cloud Connect Conference 2011. Randy just wrapped up his keynote talk here at the event. Randy, I wonder uh, if you could talk a little bit about, you, know, you described a lot of the hyper growth that's happening on the, on the commodity public clouds. Where do you see um, friction still taking place for enterprise adoption of cloud services, both in public cloud as well as private clouds? Um, the big friction, it seems to me, is in folks just getting their head around this new model of developing their apps more that web style rather than the enterprise style. And the folks who have adopted that model are not having really any problems with adopting uh, public clouds and, in fact, are driving a lot of the growth today. And it's really the folks who sort of have a very difficult time understanding how to re-architect or rebuild their applications that are struggling the most. Great. Okay. And where do you see... Uh, the where do you see us headed with this? Where's sort of the future of cloud computing? What do you think is next on the horizon? Well, when I when I think about the most critical things that need to happen, I really think about infrastructure clouds needing to become really more like a true utility, being uh, services that you can consume like you would consume electricity, which means and getting sort of a very wide deployment. Right now, you can't get an infrastructure cloud everywhere in the world. We'd like to be able to see that change. Um, and then another part of that is um, enabling folks to basically figure out how to move um, existing legacy applications by transforming them to web applications in order to uh, to drive adoption. Great, and you know you covered a lot of ground in your keynote talk today. I wonder if you could give us one sort of key takeaway message for our, our audience today. Uh, enterprise clouds, enterprise infrastructure clouds um, are a myth. If they do exist in another 10 years, it'll be as a niche part of the marketplace. And um, most of what's going to happen that's exciting is going to be around the commodity infrastructure clouds that are typified by Rackspace and Amazon. And that's really going to be how we get infrastructure to become more of a utility like electricity or um, any of the other kinds of utilities we consume, telecommunications, these things. Great. Randy, great job today. Thanks for your time. Thanks, Steve. Okay.